Hey there, this is Jen with The Breeze at Four Winds Quilting. Just a reminder that it is finally here. The CAFE Cobblestone class is coming up this week. It's going to be Saturday. So sign up if you want to do some work with putting some beautiful CAFE fabric together. For those of you that like precision or just want to learn how to make some new kind of blocks, we have been getting some fantastic foundation papers in. Come check these out. If you're looking for a fun spring color quilt to put together, I recommend our newest kit called Gypsy Soul. That's the name of the fabric line. The pattern we used is called Swift. I wanted to show you highlights from our store website this week. So the easiest way to get there is just to go to Google and type Four Winds Quilting, or if you just happen to remember that we start our website with the number four instead of the word, you can use that. And that's our website up at the top. When you come to our website, this is the main page that you see. It's called our home page. And so every time you click the word home up here, it brings you back to this page. We put little notes at the top, and then we also have a section where we try to spotlight a few different items some of them are things that we just think are particularly neat that came in in the past couple of weeks. Others are kits that have been really popular that have been selling. Others are things that people have had requests about. A lot of people have been asking about wide backs. So that's why we put that one up here. I guess everybody's finishing up those quilts they've been working on. So this is our section of wide backs, which are the 108. This one is one of the new ones, the Paisley ones, and then the floral ones that go with the Lori Holtz flea market are new as well. And so we try to keep those in because people are always asking us about wide backs. We obviously have a section on fabrics. That's our top thing that we have in our store. If you want to look at all the fabrics, you can just click the word fabrics. And all of the ones that we have online are in here. So you could click through 93 pages of fabric if you wanted to. But we also limited it for you or put some categories in based on things that a lot of people ask about. You can also use little click boxes on the side if you particularly know you're looking for a mode of fabric. That will limit it and you can click it there. Um, you can certainly type in certain things like if you happen to know that you are particularly looking for something with oops, cats, just type the word cat. I will tell you that when you do that, sometimes things pop up and you're like, there is no cat in that fabric. I don't understand. It's because the letters are in the same order in a particular description or title or something like that. Like Catalina, obviously, Paint the Town, has the word cat in its description box right here where it says cat right above the little cursor. So that's why that one is showing up there. So... But usually, if, if you know what you're looking for, you'll, you'll get it somewhere up near the top most of the time. Um, so that's probably my favorite way to look for things is using the search engine up here or off to the side. The next thing that you come to is kits. These are typically the kits that we make, but we also include some of the commercial kits that we may have gotten. So if you click on it, it'll take you to different kits. And, you know, we're not perfect. Sometimes we put strange things in strange places just by accident. Um, but usually you can find what you're looking for if you're looking for one of the kits that we have in store. If we don't have it, it's because we just don't have a picture up yet. And if you know what it is, if you call us, we probably have it made. We just don't have it on the website yet. And you can give us a call, which our phone number is right up here up at the top. Uh, so... If you wanted to look for one of those ones that I showed you just a minute ago, like the Gypsy, whoops, let's spell it correctly. You can type it in, and sure enough, it's one of the top ones that comes up, and you can click on it, and that's your kit right there. This is an example of some of the fabrics that are in it, um, and I just know that because I remembered it was called Gypsy Soul, and that's we named it after the fabric line. So if you want to see a little bit more about those particular fabrics, um, you can click on any of those. But if you wanted the kit, you just click on it here and add it to your cart. And then a little mini cart pops up and shows you, hey, it's in my cart. Woohoo! Up next are Notions. And Notions is 
a giant category, to be honest. It has lots of different things. So as you can see, we have several different subcategories in this particular section, just because it's basically anything to do with quilting except for the fabric. So if you know you need something requiring cutting or scissors or anything like that, you're going to find it in this section. Rulers and templates. This is going to be like those foundation papers that I was telling you about in the video. In fact, you can see one of them right here. Uh, but like I said before, for me personally, I like using the search box. So I would probably, as I already have done, type in the foundation word and then just make sure you hit enter and you'll get a page that's more focused. Um, but again, if you like clicking through and seeing some of the other things that we have, you're always welcome to search however you want. Um, but just like before, if you click on the item, it'll bring you here. It may tell you a little bit more about it. It may not. It just kind of depends on how much time we've had to put it in a description or whether or not the company that put the product out has included a description. But if you ever have questions, again, you can always give us a call or send us an email. But if you're interested in that one, all you got to do is click Add to Cart. And just like before, there it is. It put, put it in my cart. Uh, patterns, these are just going to be like what you think they are. They are quilt patterns. Some of the patterns that have to do with quilt patterns may show up in things like totes if they include table runners or things like that. Um, so there may be some crossover. You may see a pattern in more than one place. Sample quilts are older samples that we've had before. And um, we no longer have the kits for them or the fabric to make the kits. So we offer the samples. Uh, up for people to purchase. If you are interested, you can just click on one and find more about it. If it's, you know, you need a quilt fast, that's a good place to find one. Machines, this is a section where we talk about the different machines from Janome and Elna that we carry in the store. It won't give you prices or anything like that because our owner likes for people to come in and test drive and then she can answer questions and help you find a machine that really does suit your specific needs. Classes and calendar kind of go hand in hand. I'm going to start with calendar, even though it's the last one. This is just a picture of our calendar of what we have going on in the store. This is the one for January, obviously, and February is up. But you can see what we have, but you can't click on anything. It won't take you to any of the particular classes. To do that, you actually have to go to the classes tab. And like I said, if you wanted to sign up for a class, you can do that here or in store. All you have to do is click on the pink section and it takes you to the page. It tells you that the class is $5, but just a reminder, you have to pay for the kit as well. So you have to click on the date because you have to tell it when you want to take it just in case there happens to be more than one day for a certain class. And you also have to put your name in so we know who's coming. <laughs> and then you can click Add to Cart. So there's a couple of steps there, and then that can be a little bit confusing sometimes, but you do have to do all of those things. Um, and then just as a reminder, you, you had that, so you want to get the kit. So let's pretend we're doing that too. See? All right, there we go. So there's the kit, and put it in my cart. And there you go. If you're interested in gift certificates or you know somebody wants to get you a gift certificate or somebody or you just want to share that you're interested in one, all you got to do is t send them here, click on it, and then they can pick different denominations in this particular area and put your name in and whatnot. Shipping is just information about our shipping. And if you have questions about it, you can always talk to Nancy. We do like to point out that if you go over $100, you can get free shipping. Also, subscriptions. We offer several subscription programs at this time. Some of them you can sign up for here on the website. Others you have to give us a call because the start date has already passed. Um, but you can still sign up. It's just you won't get the previous kits necessarily. But this one in particular you can sign up online. Uh, it's the pillow of the month. It hasn't actually started yet. And uh, it's actually going to start in March for the April pillow, and then it'll continue through 2022. Login is where you can go and create an account. Actually, create an account, you have to go down here and click Create Account. 
it brings you to another page. You would put in your email address. Don't use the one that's been showing. That's my husband's. And create a password as well, just like you normally would do. And it uh, has a little bit of information on there about what the password should look like. But you can take care of all that. When you do that, uh, just make sure to give us a heads up at some point so that if you have an account linked in our store, we can make sure all of those points and everything get merged together so that you just have one account and then you don't have points in two different places. When you go to check out, if you're ready to do that, you just click like you normally would, proceed to check out. Your item should appear. I would always double check and make sure you didn't accidentally double click something or anything like that. If you have a coupon, you just put the coupon code in here or the gift certificate code in here and apply it. You can check out here or you can use PayPal. Uh, if you check out here, you just do what you normally do. Uh, we do offer in-store pickup or curbside pickup. And you just put your information in here and it'll figure out your shipping. If you have a note for us, like you want us to finish a bolt or something like that, if you're trying to get different things or you for sure only want this amount and if we can't cover that amount to give you a call or whatever. Just leave us notes about those types of things. Some of the items that we have offer like different colors or something if you want a particular color. Just like normal, you can leave us different information about those kind of things before you check out. And uh, so check out our website if you haven't done so. It's a really fun place to, or we think it's a really fun place to go and spend a little bit of time. There's links to our Facebook and our Instagram and then of course YouTube you already know about if you're watching this video. Uh, we also have information just about the story of Nancy and how everything got stored it, started. And uh, so anyway, check out our website if you haven't had a chance to do that. Thanks, have a great day.